Louisiana's Old State Capitol is so proud to present our latest exhibit called 40 Chances, Finding Hope in a Hungry World. This exhibit and this book of the same name were created as a result of a challenge. The challenge was presented by Warren Buffett, one of the world's wealthiest people. He made that challenge to his family members. And what was it? Well, after announcing he wasn't going to leave a cent of the billions he made, the billions of dollars he's made over his career, that he wasn't going to leave a penny to his family. He was going to spend it all on philanthropic causes. He then challenged his family, if I were to set up a foundation in your name with money in it, how would you use that money to make the world a better place? Well, his son Howard, a farmer, decided he would work towards ending world hunger. This exhibit and the book talks about his journey in doing just that. Howard Buffett traveled all over the world, but realized that hunger happens here in the United States as well. The book and the exhibit talk about how things grow, why things grow better here in the United States than most parts of the world, why things don't grow in Africa, the soil there is just not meant for growing food, um, and he also talked about better growing methods that would help preserve topsoil. Some of the truths that he found was, first of all, this problem isn't easy to solve, and he gave himself a deadline of 40 years to solve world hunger. That's based on an old farmer's maxim. You've got 40 seasons in which to grow your crops. If it doesn't work one season, you've got 39 more to perfect your craft and do it better next year. Buffett realized that there isn't one solution available that works across the globe, across different growing landscapes. But he did find some truths throughout the world. Um, he found that hunger is associated with uh, strife in an area, including war. It's associated with poverty and famine in general. Um, and it's also associated in places where women do not have an equal chance. Conflict is a leading cause of hunger. So if people are fighting in your neighborhood, or if your family members have been killed off, or if the fields have been destroyed because they're, they've been mined, mines have been put in the soil, you're not going to be able to get regular meals throughout the day. This exhibit also captures photographs that Howard Buffett took in areas where uh, having guns was a bigger priority than having meals. Um, it's a source of chaos, creates refugees, orphans, and child soldiers. Not necessarily a recipe for making a nutritious meal. The results of genocide are far worse than just reducing the numbers of people living in your village. Um, it also means your shelter and of course your food is, and your source of food is taken away from you. Many children who've lost parents and other family members are forced into prostitution, into child prisons, and other unspeakable horrors. Most of us have heard about programs where philanthropic groups are bringing fresh, clean water to villages across the world. In general, this works. Unless there's war getting in the way or other governmental strife, bringing fresh water to a community is essential in making sure there's also fresh food and disease-free living for many of the occupants in that village. Uh, Warren Buffett and his son Howard are very involved in bringing fresh water uh, to people all over the world. This is an essential part of making sure that people are also well fed. Through uh, Howard Buffett's philanthropic endeavors, he's been able to introduce sustainable farming techniques in areas that before were very difficult to farm. He's also been able to prepare children at refugee camps for a future of good farming practices. And remarkably enough, in Zambia, notorious elephant poachers actually set aside their guns to learn responsible farming techniques and how to distribute food safely to the people of their villages. 
there are inklings of hope and each generation that builds upon the last this problem gets better and better until perhaps it will be solved